Welcome to the Nicholas 11X12 technology. Today I'd like to compare the Intel i3-4150 with the AMD FX6300 and FX6350 processors. All three of these CPUs are priced very similarly and that's why I'm doing this comparison. The FX6350 costs the most, then comes the i3-4150 and last the FX6300, which costs less than the i3. To find out which processor is the better choice, let's take a look at the benchmarking results. Alright, the Intel i3-4150 does very well when it comes to video rendering, but when it comes to 3D rendering and all that stuff, as well as video encoding, the AMD FX6300 and FX6350 CPUs do much better. Gaming wise it's pretty much a tie. There are games out there where the FX CPUs perform better than the i3 and vice versa. However, the performance difference isn't that big, but overall I'd say the FX6300 and 6350 processors are the winners in gaming. The power consumption as always on Intel CPUs is lower of course, but it's not an extreme large difference. It's just a matter of how much you care about some extra wattage. The choice here is not an easy one between these CPUs. The FX CPUs have unlocked multipliers though, whereas the i3 has a locked one, which means you can't overclock. By overclocking you would be able to increase the performance even further. So yeah, all processors have their benefits and disadvantages, but if you ask me, the effect CPUs are slightly better here in this case since they're cheaper as well. Well I mean the FX6300 is cheaper, but when judging the price performance ratio, the FX6350 is the best choice here in my opinion. Still, in the end it's your choice and not mine. You decide which of these CPUs is the winner. I hope I could help you out somehow with this video. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas11x12techx.com to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.